Hello! In this video I'm going to show you some of the processes I went through to make my Sleigh Bell Cat cosplay. Um, mainly on my daggers because they just took so long so I have more footage of those but hey. I don't use Warbler. Warbler is super good, it's amazing. If you can afford Warbler buy it but I just really, I can't warrant spending that much on some thermal plastic so yeah. So if you didn't cut your finger off with a Stanley knife while making your cosplay it's not going to be as cool as mine. The trip to hospital just gives it that bit of, you know, edge. Um, battle hardened yeah um yeah thank you for watching i hope it helps if it doesn't i'm sorry if it does comment talk to me i mean i have no friends so i've got so much time for you um yeah thank you for watching goodbye first of all you want to find a picture of cat's dagger and you want to draw the outline of the dagger onto a piece of craft foam and then you want to cut the outline out and carve the insides i do the insides first because they're a bit tricky i use a stanley knife you want to do this three more times you need two sides to each dagger so you need four pieces in total then i put it onto a piece of card and i draw the outline and i carve the inside bits first because it's much easier with more to hold and then i draw the well cut the outline out when you're pushing the middle bits out be careful because they're quite small some of them quite flimsy so if you do break one like i do just hot glue gun it back together that's what i did anyway um then i use pva glue and smeared it all over it and sandwiched it between two pieces of craft foam and then I tried to sand it down with this Dremel thing but I don't know if it worked but I just wanted to make it like look sharp on the edges and then I carved the well cut out the stars for the handles while they go above the handles like this now I mix together water and PVA glue to the consistency of milk and I paint that all over my daggers I did it about I think 16 times 16 coats and I've got marker pen all over my handle, and that will come through in the acrylic paint, so I just used some, like, I think it's canvas primer. Added some coats of that to the handle. I didn't video myself painting, because I was watching Once Upon a Time, and I was addicted to it, so I would have rather watched that than videoed myself, but, um, I just bought some acrylic paint, gold, green and red, and white, and I just painted it, like normal. And I used a sponge, I didn't use a paintbrush for the this because I didn't want streak marks so I used this like weird spongy thing and it really worked really well and it got all the silly bits of foam that were poking out and I put darker gold inside these bits you can't really tell but I did um, and then I just did loads of layers of PVA glue and water again all over to make it look quite shiny and that's all I did for my swords for the dress you just want a black velvet choker um, a bell both brought on eBay I just attached them together I bought a bag of already like tied ribbons, green, obviously. Um, this is a black lacy strapless bra, but I have put invisible straps with it. I sewed, oh, I've sewn the dress onto the bra and I have cut out very thin pieces of this lovely material to stitch on these. I've only stitched them onto the top. I've stitched the bow on. Um, as you can see, they're all still ready, like can flap up. So I am going to use fabric glue, which I have lost, but I'm going to use fabric glue and I'm going to just stick that down nice and easy. Okay, so what I have done here is cut out some of that pleather vinyl stuff, this, and I cut four strips of it. And then I have pinned it where I wanted them to overlap and I have used this smelly, disgusting fabric glue, which takes like 30 minutes to dry on here. I didn't realise it took that long. I'm going to use it to paste down these in a minute. Anyway, she has crisscross ribbon cross in here so it goes from there to there and there to there okay if I just splodge that there because it takes half an hour to fucking dry like that hold it there for 10 hours like that the belt will go around here like this these are my antlers. I carved them out on the same foam stuff, like that foam board thing I did for my inside of my daggers. And then I just painted them brown. And a bit of PVA glue got stuck to them and they're a bit mm, yummy. Anyway, then for my hair, in her in the game, she has like these really cute lights in her hair. So what I did is I brought these like LED lights. Oh god, they're really bright. And they change colour. And I had those dangled around here to look really pretty. Um, and then it got really, really matted in the wig, so I just ripped it off. Yeah. So, I, I did have a few more, but, yeah. I bought loads of them, they're really cool. If you put them in water, they look amazing. 
Yeah, woo. I thought it was a really good idea. It was. My s Jasmine. My st oh, shut up and no. My stockings are around my Oh seriously, Jasmine. <sighs> anyway, my stockings are like this. You know when you take them off they obviously like regain all that elastic stretchiness, so they are um I didn't want to sew the sew around Ugh, sew the sew, sew the snow around them. So what I've done is I've got how can I show you? I obviously put this I put the socks on my leg and then I put cut out some snow like I did for my dress. And then I stripped it round like that. And so that's how big my thigh is and the sock will stretch to that. So to attach it I've put these little thingies, I can't remember what they're called like popper things. And then I just pop them in to the sock like that on both sides. Two poppers? So I can just put the sock on and then you want, oh my god it's stuck put it round, it's my sewing so it will come off and then I just put the little green bows that I bought in the middle of the sock and I did that twice um, there was some more stuff in between my legs, hang on this is the glove, I bought these on ebay they're like shiny, kinky stuff woo, quite stretchy um, to look like leather because oh, leather gloves are well expensive and I'm just so poor Where's there's something else I was meant to show you oh yeah, last thing is this. This goes around my arm. I just bought more of those socks I'm wearing and cut off the good bits. And that goes around my arm like hers does. And I think that is everything. Yes. I am all dressed up for my cosplay and my sister has just taken loads of pictures of me so I'm all done and I can take it off because this wig is itching me like crazy. Um, thank you for watching if you got this far. Um, yeah, if you've got any questions or if I missed anything out I will tell you absolutely everything. Um, yeah, so please like maybe subscribe to me if you'd like to um comment nice things that'd be nice yeah that's about it really isn't it yeah hope you like it have an amazing christmas and i hope you get lots of presents if you don't get any presents then uh, unlucky i don't know where i'm going with this really i'm going downstairs to play gta with my dad and he has just unlocked trevor and the cutscene was just so awkward but anyway, have a lovely Christmas, seriously. Bye. Thank you. Bye.